are you ready to learn the entire how to play Yu-Gi-Oh? I am. Good, because... Do you want to go first or second? Um, I'll go second. All right, I'll go first then. I'm going to activate scapegoat and proceed to do nothing for multiple turns. What is all of that? Hmm? A sheep token. Uh, have you ever seen the original Yu-Gi-Oh show? No. Okay, I was gonna say Joey uses his card a lot. They can't do anything. They're just generic monsters. They're meat shields. That's all they are. They're just meat shields. Yeah, they okay. even take up a thought damage goes through. It, okay. If the monster is in attack position or if your monster says it pierced or if the monster does piercing damage. I see. So if they're def in defense, they'll just eat it all up. Gotcha. So the purple monster you have in your extra deck, Beowulf, he can mm -hmm. pierce. Mm -hmm. Your deck doesn't actually have polymerization. Instead, what it has is Dark Contract with the Gate and Dark Contract Forbidden Swamp. Forbidden Swamp will let you fuse, okay? And if you use Dark Gate, you can enter Forbidden Swamp to your hand. Ah, shit. I forgot to turn off the timer. Sorry. I don't even see where it is. I was just reading. The timer under, under your name is running low. I forgot to turn that off. Sorry. I'll turn it off next round. Why can't I... S hmm? I, I want him to play his skill. She doesn't have a skill. She does. He's a it pendulum monster. Can... What is it? That doesn't mean anything to me. What, yeah. what does that mean? Okay, what skill are you talking about? On it, it says, once per turn, during your standby phase... Increase this, this pendulum, this card's right, pendulum skill by two. Creature. I saw some creature was able to allow me to play one DD card. D slash D card, I thought. I must have read it wrong. What cards are in your hand? If you tell me, then I can probably help you a bit. I have D slash D. Doom King Argama. Armageddon? Yeah. That Supreme is. Supreme King Kaiser. And. Okay. And uh, then a bunch of traps and... End your turn. Far. End your turn or else you'll lose in 40 seconds. <clears throat> Wait, does this... Okay, now you can read out your hand. So if you have another Savant card in your hand that has a pendulum scale of 8 or above, do activate that one as well, okay? Eight or above. Do you mean the star count or no, the diamond count? Diamond. You see how on Savant Galilee, he has he has diamonds right next to his middle effect. You next mean to the one blue and the red. Yes, those are called pendulum. That's called a pendulum scale. Oh. I got two, I got a card with four and four, but I don't got one with eight. What, do you have any other pendulum monsters in your hand? Nope. Okay. If you have one with eight or higher, then you can summon as many cards from your hand as monsters. That was a terrible move, because it has to be between one and four. And currently you're at between three and four, so you can't do anything.
I don't understand what the hell was going on. What in the fuck is this deck? <laughs> I don't know how complex, but my brain is trying. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead. <laughs> don't worry, I'm about to show you. Please don't make... <laughs> what the fuck is this deck? You see this guy? Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm dead. This one and this one to my hand. Can these be used for? Ooh, can these be used for synchro summon? Can they? Oh, they can. Okay. Noble Dragon is a tuner. You remember how synchro monsters work, right? No. <laughs> Essentially. I think you have to have a certain you have to have a regular monster and a synchro monster in order to do your um you have special to have summoning of some type. You have to have a tuner, tuner. monster. Yeah. And then essentially whatever the rest of it says, plus mm -hmm. one or two or whatever it says, one tuner, and then it'll say something else. Usually non tuner monster. And then from that it's essentially math. Noble Dragon is level three. Of each of my sheep tokens is level <laughs> one. Which, what number does this, does that make? Seven. Um. What? You oh, essentially geez. use the tuner monster, and you add it. it, it once you have the tuner monster, you essentially add the numbers together. So it's the tuner monster plus however many other monsters you need in order. So Noble Dragon was level 3, right? The sheep tokens were Where each level is 1. Noble Dragon? Hmm? Where, where is Noble, Noble Dragon? Did you already... Yeah, I already synchro summoned it. That was the oh, monster right. that I used. Actually, I think it's at the top of my deck right now. New, uh, what card did you just get? Dark Arm Dragon. Ooh. Okay, if we wait two more turns... Then you will actually be able to pendulum summon. Because Savant Galilei, his effect makes his pendulum scale go up by two every turn. So, meaning in two turns he'll be scale nine, meaning you can summon any monsters you have between level five, from levels five to eight. Do you understand that? Kind of. No. You see the two pendulum scale monsters you have? Doom King and Galilei? Yeah. Numbers from 4 to 5 you are able to summon. So any monster in between that. You get it? So... so what I'm hearing is that it has to be between, be between the 1 and the 4 in order to be summoned. No, if you hover over Savant, right now he's at 5. If you hover over him, you can see that. Where would I see that at? Just hover your mouse over him. Yes, I'm hovering my mouse yeah. over him. You I don't see, see how it five. has two 5s? What two 5s? Are you hovering your mouse over Galileo's? Oh, that, that's what you mean. It's actually on him. I'm looking at the card on the side. No, I mean hover your mouse. Yeah. No, I, I am hovering my mouse over Yeah, him. look at I the fucking mouse. I just didn't mouse. see the black box. I didn't see the black box down there. You just said <laughs> hover over it. I'm looking over here at the side. I'm like, all right, hover over it. I see the card pop up on the side. I'm expecting it to pop up over there. Nothing's over there. Look down at my mouse, it's there. Oh, okay. sorry. I shouldn't explain anybody. 
Anyway, so any numbers have between to. five and four you can summon. Okay. Which Let's there see. are no numbers between five and four that aren't. Yeah. There are no whole numbers between those, you know. So you can't. But if you wait two turns, then it will be between nine and four. Which you have Supreme King Kaiser in your hand, right? End your turn, by the way. You got 20 seconds. Oh. Um. So, let me give you a demo. And, you want to know the crazy part? What? That's summon? Wait. I, I, I did the wrong... Yeah. Fuck. I just destroyed my own monster. <laughs> Let that go through. Because I just destroyed my own monster on accident. What I was going to I say... What the, I don't understand what I could do. Is... A pendulum summon counts as a special summon. Okay. So, do you know what that means? Special summon? Um, you still have a normal summon. Yeah. Is what it means. So, see? I now have two monsters. Yeah. That was a horrible idea. White swarms are assholes. Because they destroy the user's deck. Aw, oh, damn it! Really? <laughs> really what? Like, like, somehow I managed to get terraforming, which lets you add a field spell from your deck to your hand, and then the field spell. Both of them were sent to the graveyard. So... Once you start your turn, Galilei will be at seven. What are your two face downs? Um, emergency provisions and human resources. Activate human resources. Send Doom King Armageddon. Select Doom King Armageddon because it will let you do that, right? Oh, uh, whoops. Select oh, Doom I King on the that. No. <laughs> Why did you activate that? I don't know. It's a good question. Well, target DVD human resources because you'll just gain a thousand life points and you can still use resources. So pick Armageddon and then pick two cards yeah. from your hand you don't want. Okay. Cannot. You can't pick him? I cannot. Oh. Uh, oh. You did. You definitely did. Add two to... Add two demon... Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, hold on. Let me tell you which one's to add, okay? Okay. You have Savant Kepler and Savant Copernicus. Add those two to your hand. So Savant Copernicus. And Savant Kepler. Kepler, yeah, I clicked him. Wait, do you you yeah. have Nicola? You have Nicola, right? Nicola, let me see. Armageddon, Ragnarok, Chivalar, Lilith. Tell me the right Savant now. you have. I see one Savant Kepler. I clicked on him already. Okay. Oh, you... There's Copernicus. There you go. Why'd it do that? Set them. Activate them. Activate or set? Activate. Quickly, you have 20 seconds. No, just... Actually, no, don't activate them. Just end your turn, okay?
Damn it. There go three more of my cards. Why'd you lose three more? Life Swarms destroyed the user's deck, so this, yep, now activate Copernicus. Now you can Pendulum Summon. Hover over Kepler, and you should say Special Summon. Now from your hand, any monsters from level 9, nine to 2, you can Special Summon from your hand right now. Is this dude not a... Uh... I'm confused. Oh, I should be able to summon my Dark Dragon. You clicked. Is he a... If it's not a DDD, I mean, if it's not a DD monster, you oh. can't. Oh, that's well. Because of Kepler's effect. Why did you do that? Because this is the only thing I got. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, I said special summon, not normal summon. Oh, that wasn't a DD. Oh, I don't have any DD monsters. <laughs> yeah. I thought you had Supreme King Kaiser. Yeah, and then he got nuked. <laughs> oh. Well, guess what you can do? Did you normal summon him? Yeah. End your turn. Okay. I Activate his effect. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. That one. Swamp King. Add one extravated trap spell card to your hand. Activate, I mean, add Spell King. I mean, I'm, I hope you mean Swamp King? Yeah, sorry, I, I don't know why I said Spell King. I'm, you oh, said Spell confused. and it confused me, I'm sorry. It's a spell. I was confused for a second. I was like, uh, Spell King? Uh, he must mean Swamp King. No, I, I mean... probably ask before I do something that I don't have a clue for what I am doing. Hmm. I really have fucked myself, haven't I? <laughs> really should not send that. What's the angel do? Or Lila? Yeah. This. She did for. Did you just? I destroyed your Kepler. Why would you do that? You asked what it did. The heck, man! I hope you. I hope <laughs> you run out of cards before you kill me. Oh, I will. Or I'll draw uh, that pendulum dragon next time. One of the two. Man, what is the point of this dark armed dragon if I can't normal summon him? You can special summon him. Yeah, I can't even get there. <laughs> yeah, you could have. So, I actually forgot you had him. If you hadn't of some... If I had to remember that, you could have actually used... Oh, no, wait. No, you couldn't have. There was actually no way you could have brought him out. He's You can special summon whenever you have exactly three dark-type monsters in your graveyard. You have four. So, if you had gotten one less from Karee Bandit's effect, you would have been able to special summon him. Also, you should not have done that because you have no DDD monsters in your deck. I'm in your hand right now. Actually, what's yeah. your face down? Uh, Strigan Street Patrol. Well, that's not helpful. What's his effect do? Hmm? Thank you. Um, if this card destroys a monster in the battle... And sends it to the graveyard. Inflict damage to your opponent equal to original level of that monster in the graveyard. Times why would you dungeon. not? Why would you not use that to attack my light swarm? That's a good question. I was <laughs> thinking about defense, sir. I didn't really read it. I just wanted something out on the field. All right. Just for note, if a monster's in defense position, it can't attack, period. 
unless you switch unless you're able to switch it back into attack position. Oh, that's cool. So he dies next turn. Understood. No, because I'm not going to attack him because I want you to destroy Lyra. So that I don't deck out, remember? But I don't want to kill Lyra. So you do deck out. Okay, but then I can't teach you and we have to then we have to restart the entire fucking duel. That works for me. Oh, okay. Well, if that's what you say. I'll just kill you then. No, 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 no. You can deck out, bud. No, 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 How, how have I still not seen my baby? By the way, you take a thousand damage. Did you read or did you just click? I um knew that it could do something, and I just kind of assumed and just sacked him. Well, you just saved yourself a thousand life points. Yeah. Oh. But do you have another one? You're just clicking at random, aren't you? I'm doing a lot. Oh, I didn't want it to go there. Why did you do that? I wanted to go to one of the middle slots. Why didn't immediately go to the outside? You can't. Okay. Good face. Doesn't matter though, because I didn't have any D and D monsters anyway, and none are dropping, so doesn't matter. See what happens. Well. Guess what? Do it. Activate something. Activate something. I dare you. Do it. Do it. See what happens. Do it. I know you want to. Are you going to activate it, or are you, you did? Oh! <gasps> That's not helpful in the slightest! God damn it, Joker! Wait. Oh. Now this, on the other hand, is extremely helpful. Now I'm about to teach you something called Link Summoning. Beyond the You mean the little square things? Oh no, whatever will I do? I'll ice punch on dragon. Now, allow me to show you how to pendulum summon. I have scale 8. Dragon Pit Magician and Scale 1 Dragon Pulse Magician. From my hand, I call Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon level 7 and Skull Crabat Joker level 4. And I will now give you some help by destroying that and this, whatever that is. Your job, spell cards. Trap cards. Yeah. You're gonna die. I'm gaining life. Yeah, well, guess what? 
The light's about to be taken. I fusion summon. Which you don't know what that is. So you're just about to take a lot of damage. I said I can go twice. Hmm? And I said I can do a lot. Unless it can attack twice. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, it can't. Up to two attacks on monsters. Where's my banish pile? Hmm? Where's the banish pile? The one above your graveyard. Where's the graveyard? The place where cards have been going every time you use one. Or it dies. Well, there's a, um, oh, you mean that black spot up there? Yeah, I mean uh, the one above, the one above your deck. Where's banished dark, what? Hmm? Where do banished cards go? The area above, the one above your deck. Oh. I don't have any of that. that yes, I know. No, it does not. Beyond the pendulum! Why do you keep doing that? You don't have any DDD monsters. Yes, and I don't have anything else to do neither. I just, I'm just playing stuff, alright? Okay. Allow it. <laughs> it's not like I'm going to live next turn, okay? I gotta do something. I was trying to teach you, and then you were like, nah, nah, let him deck out. So now I'm just gonna murder you. And you should have just decked out. Now why would I do that? Why? Why would you not just deck out? You're losing three cards a turn. Allow it. <laughs> no. I refuse. Oh, oh. You ready for a rematch? Yeah. How did I do that? Now I'll send you a link. Oh, dude.